So in this video, we're going to talk about estimating the area of irregular figures made up of squares and rectangles. So for example, we have this figure. So this is an irregular figure or shape. And it's given that one side is 10 centimeters and another side is 7 centimeters. And we are going to cut it such that it will form regular shapes so we can solve for the area. But even if we cut it, the given is not enough to solve this. There is no length or width in the box at the bottom. And it's not possible for us to find it. Now if we are going to change the cut and make it that way, still the information is not enough to find the area of these two boxes or rectangles. And so the only way to solve this is to estimate the area. So we cannot get the exact but at least we can have the estimate area of this irregular shape. So how to get an estimation of this figure? So first thing to do is to make some imaginary lines, we call it grid, for each side. So starting from the top to bottom, it's 10 centimeters, so we're going to divide it into 10 parts. So that's it. So those are imaginary lines for 10 parts, as well as from the width. So since it's 7, so we're going to divide it into 7 parts. And then it forms uh, small squares. So those whole squares will be considered as 1 or 1 square centimeters. And those squares that is just partial, so we don't know how much is the area of that part. So we'll just assume that it's 0.5. So that's why we call it estimate estimating so it's just an estimation so if whatever it is as long as it's not a whole one square centimeters it's just a partial so it's assumed to be only 0.5 so now let's count how many blocks which are a holes whole square so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, and 42. So there are 42 whole blocks of squares. And how many are those uh, just partial squares so we have this one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so there are ten of the partial which will be counted as 0.5 so the area is approximately so we use this symbol approximately equal to because we're just estimating there are 42 of whole uh, blocks plus the 0.5 times how many of them there are 10 so 10 times 0 0.5 is 5 so 42 plus 5 which will be 47 square centimeters so the estimated area of this irregular shape is 47 or approximately equal to 47 square centimeters now let's have another figure. So here's another irregular figure. And we only have two given measures of each side, which is obviously not enough to uh, solve the exact area of this figure. And so we're going to create grids to estimate the area of this figure. So let's start with the three meters. So we're going to divide it into three parts. So uh, as you can see, we uh, intentionally make uh, make it longer than the figure. So the longer the grid, the better. So don't uh, mind the extra. And then um, we're going to continue with the same 
length until the whole figure is covered. And then we will do the same to the column. So we have this 4 meters. So each uh, line will uh, represent 1 meter. So we'll continue that so that the figure will be all covered. So now it is covered with the grids and then we're going to plot the blocks. So first is the blocks for the whole square. So each square is uh, covering one square meters. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then the next part is not whole square. So it's just partially shaded. So we will not include that. So that's eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. So there are 36 squares that are a uh, whole uh, shaded. So and then we're going to count as well those uh, partially shaded, which will be counted as 0.5. So let's count them first. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So there are 11 of them, including that part which is very, very small. So no matter how small it is, we will count it as 0.5. Even if you can see it like it's more than a half of a square but everything will be counted as 0.5 because this is an estimation and so the area of this irregular figure will be so 36 that's the uh, for the squares which are whole shaded plus the 0.5 there are 11 of them so 0.5 times 11 will be 5.5 so it will be 36 plus 5.5. So the area or estimated area will be approximately equal to 41.5 square meters. Thanks for watching and I hope you have learned from this video. Please support my channel by pressing the subscribe button and write the math topics you want to learn in the comment section.